So what's the difference between democracy and mob rule? Interesting conversation. Check it out. Leave your comments, ding the bell, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel. My question is, uh, you know, mob rule. Libertarians will obviously say this is mob rule, which makes it not right. Um, right. Could you explain the difference between, you know, I read on Google that a mob rule is when citizens do things that are outside the realm of the law, so it's not That's legal. Correct. Um, That's right. Could you explain how, you know, uh, the representative democracy we have in the United States is not mob rule and aquacracy? Sure. Well, first of all, mob rule uh, doesn't, you know, mobs don't respect rules. <laughs> So, uh, you know, what we have done is we, by creating the Constitution and by creating a set of laws, we created a, 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 a structure within which we operate as a society, um, uh, you know, uh, with very specific rules. Um, therefore, it's not a mob. And then, and then we also backed away from even direct democracy. I mean, the Greek specs, you know, 3,000 years ago, um, uh, the... Uh, you, you had two forms of democracy that happened in ancient Greece or in Athens, actually. Um, one was basically everybody shows up and votes. The other was they boiled it down to 6,001 people. Um, and that was their, I forget the word for it. Um, but if you, it, it was like jury duty. You, you would, your name would be called once a, you know, every year they would call 6,001 names. And, and if you didn't show up, you were called an idiota. And, but that was the group, it was like jury duty, they made the decisions for, for uh, Greece or Athens, one or the other. Um, so we didn't even do that. You know, we decided that instead we would have a representative uh, democracy. Um, so we've, we have a constitutionally right. limited, that is the Constitution limits the, the, uh, uh, the Constitution limits the, the, um, the powers essentially of government. Number one, and then number two, from from the Constitution limiting the powers of government, um, then you have elected representatives who who you know add another layer of kind of buffer between you know the mob, as it were, the you know the general public. So no, we don't have mob rule. It's nothing, not even close to mob rule. Libertarians love to say it's a mob rule because people like Charles Koch, you know, billionaire right wing libertarians, um, yeah. they don't want the mob. That's you and me taking any of their money in the form of taxes, and so they tend to say that taxes are mob rule. And that programs that benefit, you know, more than half of Americans, so Social Security, Medicare, Medicaid, things like that, that's mob rule. Um, but basically what they're complaining about is it's taking money out of their pockets. It's just real simple.